Hey, we're out here today at the Gator Proving Grounds showing off one of our hydraulic dovetail trailers. This is a 24.9 kgvw equipped with two 10,000 pound Dexter axles. We just want to highlight a few of the features on this trailer before we put it to work today and then we're going to do a quick demonstration at the end loading some equipment. What really stands this trailer out is a 14 inch I-beam mainframe with a 5 inch flange. That's 22 pound per foot. As you can see here, you have a step system that is special to Gator Made. Not only does this step allow you access up onto your trailer, this step also allows you access onto your truck to get in there to hook up. You have to do that every time. If you'll move on around back here with me, all these trailers come standard, which is especially important with a hydraulic dovetail with a winch mount there in the front. A winch works really great with the hydro tail. They mirror each other well. If you're trying to drag something up on here dead and the winch won't quite do it, you can bring the tail up to level it, vice versa. You can see our light bar there on top of the neck. Move on back down the trailer here. We do have a ratchet rail underneath all these elite dual tandems for the big four inch winch heads. Here's the axles we was talking about earlier. 10,000 pound Dexters with the 44,000 pound HDSS. Now to the point of the video today, we're gonna move around here to the hydro tail. This is a 10 foot hydraulic dovetail that requires no manual locks or levers like a lot of our competitors do. It's all in one push button that you'll see here in a minute when we do the demonstration. You bring the tail up, the springs in there automatically latch and unlatch. So you can go up and down, no need to pull any levers, anything getting a bind or anything like that. So now we're gonna take this new haul in here and this rhino bush hog, we're gonna load it on. Something like this is typically really long for a wide ramp trailer. You have to stand the ramps up with a hydraulic dovetail as you pull on here. The tail will lift the bush hog and put the load exactly how it needs to be without having to stand those wide ramps up, make a big air dam, and be a little bit clangy. So this is the ideal setup for this, what we're doing here. All right, now we're gonna finish our demo here and show you. We're gonna load this T5120 New Holland in a Woods Batwing. As he's coming around here, I want you to make a special note to pay attention to the rear end of the truck. With a normal ramp trailer, as you come up on the ramps, that puts pressure down and tries to lift the rear end of the truck and the trailer and a lot of stuff moves. Definitely makes you feel more unsafe and it is a little bit less safe. As you use this, you'll see everything stays completely steady as he pulls up on here. And like I said, pay attention to how still everything is. This is a good size tractor. see nothing move there everything stays steady you'll see a little bit of squat on the big red up there all right that's good Alex now you can see with a wide ramp trailer this has been a lot more difficult you'd have to have a lot longer trailer to do everything to fit in level this right here has no issue picking that up from tip to tail with the bucket on this load is over 30 foot but with the way he's positioned his bucket and the use of a hydraulic dovetail we're gonna have no issue getting this whole load on here with the correct weight placement on the truck. You'll see here, if you can pick it up my microphone, that clicking noise, give it just a little hit back down so it rests on the dead stops and takes the weight off that hydraulic system. With a typical wide ramp trailer, to get this load exactly on here, the way you'd want to have it positioned, you'd have to have at least a five foot longer trailer to make everything fit perfectly. Now he has the weight of his uh, equipment where he wants it for a safe and comfortable pull. Now I'm gonna lift this up and show you how this works to disengage this system since we have no manual levers, nothing getting a bind. You lift this up a little bit. If my microphone will pick it up, you'll hear a little click here. Right there. Now the tail goes back down. With a wireless remote, you can do all this by yourself, super simply. There's a small thud there. If you heard that, that's the system re-engaging for the next lift up and down. Now we're going to bring old man Alex back off here. Just keep him screaming at you. Alex, bring it back off. Screaming here a little bit. It's just keep in mind how uneventful this is compared to anyone watching this video has definitely dealt with big equipment before.
Now you can see how easy that was to use. That is the safest loading platform in the trailer industry. I do want to make a few other small points about the hydraulic dovetail while we have it out here on the proving grounds today. This does actually have enough power down to lift up the tires on the trailer. It's best to put a board down or a block here to save your tail, but as you can see there, the tires are lifted on the trailer. So if you were on the side of the road, you have enough power. Just give a little demo here. See, even the lead axle spin in there. So you have enough power bringing all that down that you could do any kind of repairs you need to on the side of the road or at the house for that matter. All right, so now what we're gonna demonstrate is if you had something else in the way up here and you're trying to make another load out of this and squeeze two pieces of equipment on the same load using the lifted capacity of the tail to bring this tractor up. We do have fluid in the tires here, so this is a little bit heavier outfit. Let's get you up here onto the wood a little bit right there. Let's lift him up here. As you can see, this has no issue bringing this up here. If you had something else on the front of this trailer, imagine this was a much longer trailer. We do this trailer all the way up to 45 foot. This is a 30 foot example. You could have got another piece of equipment on the rear here very easily. Now we're gonna lower that back down just a little bit to get that on the dead stops. And that piece of equipment is on there. Plenty of room up front. Gator made, America's selected best. To learn more about our big muscle professional grade trailers, visit GatorMade.com and find us on Facebook and YouTube.